Johnny Depp makes quiet move for Pirates of the Caribbean reboot. After all, actor Johnny Depp hasn't closed the door on Disney, and it appears the door is opening wider and broader. Several lines of conversation have taken place between fans and industry insiders on the future of Johnny Depp and the Pirates of the Caribbean franchise. After his defamation trial with ex-wife Amber Heard concluded, Depp relocated to Europe to pursue his music and acting careers. The actor's recent film, Gene Dubarry, opened at the Cannes Film Festival earlier this year, and he has numerous other projects in the works. Though Depp is dealing with rehab for a broken ankle, he honored his late friend Jeff Beck with a tribute concert earlier this year, and he has begun touring again with his band, The Hollywood Vampires, alongside Alice Cooper and Joe Perry. The talented actor was in talks to play a role in Warner Bros. Beetlejuice 2 film, which is being directed by Depp's longtime friend Tim Burton, but recent reports suggest that the production company has moved on from the actor, just as it did with the Fantastic Beasts franchise a couple of years ago when it replaced Johnny Depp with Mads Mikkelsen. With Warner Bros. out of the picture, at least for the time being, many fans have wondered if Disney might be the first Hollywood studio to welcome Depp back after several years of the actor being blacklisted. Though Disney and Johnny Depp have had a tumultuous relationship, there's no doubt that Pirates of the Caribbean, one of the company's top franchises ever, is synonymous with Captain Jack Sparrow. Disney has shared that it's moving forward with plans for a Pirates of the Caribbean 6, but its latest comments indicated that it was noncommittal on a Johnny Depp return. Though original reports said that Depp would not return to Disney, recent comments from a Johnny Depp insider put those rumors to rest. The insider said that anything is possible with Depp, and that the actor would return to Disney for the right project. Recently, Inside the Magic covered the financial woes that Depp is facing. The actor, described as cash-strapped by the Dale Mail, took out a $10 million loan for his West Hollywood castle. The property, where Depp rarely resides, was purchased by the Edward Sissorhands actor in 1995 for an estimated $2.15 million. The exact reason for this loan has not been given. With money being an issue for the actor, might he be planning a comeback to Pirates of the Caribbean just for the money? Depp is very careful about when he makes comments, but an insider mentioning that he'd be open to returning to a Disney movie could speak to some of the actor's present ideas. Though Depp may not want to return to Disney, he stated during the slander trial that he would not return for $300 million, he is aware that a large payment would be on the receiving end of a return. Pirates of the Caribbean has grossed over $4.5 billion at the box office, and with all the excitement around a will he, won't he return, it would almost certainly imply a hefty payment for the actor if he did chose to put his bootstraps back on and reprise his role as Captain Jack Sparrow once more.